video I'm going to show you how to get the order book for crypto data. I'm going to use CCXT which is a Python library but it's super simple if you want to get data for you know Binance, the Binance order book for any ticker whether that's an altcoin or Bitcoin or Ethereum or whatever. If it's for Binance, FTX, uh, Coinbase, Femex, all of these exchanges through CCXT you can actually get them so I'm gonna go ahead and just walk you through the process right here right now and I'm so proud of you for finding this video because that means you're never gonna stop you are literally unstoppable as long as you keep learning that's the coolest thing about coding is it's just piece by piece learn a new thing learn a new thing um, so I'm super psyched so just go ahead and and hit that like button real quick if you do want to uh, encourage me to keep making more videos but let's go ahead and import ccxt again if you don't know how to import ccxt ask the question below because i will help um, i'm gonna import don't share config you don't have to do this part you don't have to do the import of the don't share config it could be your own config i'll show you why i do that here in a second let's go ahead and make a symbol that we want to get the order book for let's say UBTC USD that is BTC um, using Femex let's go ahead and connect to Femex it's just one of my exchanges that I like to use uh, because you know they they give good leverage and it's just a good exchange to work with um, but like I said you could use Binance you could use uh, Coinbase you could use FTX that's what's so great about CCXT uh, now I'm gonna hit enable rate limit equals true I'm gonna put in my API key here and it should look like this something like that you get it from the settings inside of your your brokerage and then I'm gonna put the secret now as you saw I I imported a don't share config this actually holds my my codes my API key and my secret the reason I do that is because I obviously cannot show those here on the screen so I'm gonna go ahead and just import them like this and XP key and let's go ahead and do the same thing for the secret so if you're a little confused on this part uh, this is essentially just your your API keys that you get from the exchange and I'm just hiding them from the video so super simple uh, if you have any questions let me know I can I can do a walkthrough of exactly how to do that but let's go ahead and jump into the order book